if you're new to fasting or maybe you've tried it before but you're struggling to see results, honestly, I'm not surprised. There is so much mixed information trying to sell you something. Fasting Tube is independent and focusing on real information. Let's get started with today's video. The question, what is the best approach for intermittent fasting? There are a few variations that you can start with when intermittent fasting. The one that I have seen to be very popular is the fast ratio 16, 8. This means that you fast for 16 hours followed by an 8 hour eating window. You can also use different ratios other than 16, 8. You can increase the fasting window longer than 16 hours, but I wouldn't recommend fasting any less than 16 hours when doing intermittent fasting. Let's take the above ratio 16, 8. This is the ratio I have used in the past and plan to use in the future when I cut down my body fat percentage again. I will set my fasting window from 8, 0 p.m. at night and fast until 12, 0 p.m. the next day. This is a 16 hour fast. My eating window will be from 12, 0 p.m. noon until 8, 0 p.m. at night. Giving me an 8 hour eating window, and yes I am missing breakfast but trust me it's not a big deal. I will rinse and repeat this process until I want to stop intermittent fasting. I would like to note that for this process to work you are going to have to stick with it for some time to see great results. You can't simply just do it for one day and be off it. The next, you need to give your body time to get into a rhythm and let the process work. Another point to make is that you cannot consume any calories during the fasting window. That's why it is called a fast. Pretty much the only thing you can have is water, and things that contain absolutely no calories like green tea. I personal only intermittent fast when I need to cut off some body fat percentage. I find that it helps me control my diet, and allows me to achieve much greater results when losing weight because of all the benefits intermittent fasting provides. I would say a week is about the minimum you can go and see some results from intermittent fasting, and that is a pretty short amount of time. When I do intermittent fasting I usually go for about 3 months before I stop intermittent fasting. The reason I go 3 months is because this is how long it usually takes me to cut down my body fat percentage to where I want it to be, after a long bulking period. If you need more advice on intermittent fasting check, 16-8 intermittent fasting guide. If you need more advice on intermittent fasting check, 16-8 intermittent fasting guide.